Well, an art teacher of Tulsa's McKinley Elementary School emailed us about a wonderful lost and found story. A packet of student paintings had been lost back behind a cabinet. Now, a teacher found it and gave it to the art teacher. As Rick Wells shows us, the art teacher then found the student who created the paintings nearly 50 years ago. That's new this evening. Right here, okay? Dania Santiago is helping these young artists create fall color collages. Good job, kids. But it's not this art that got us here. It's this art. It's like finding a treasure. <laughs> these student paintings were found among a packet of artwork discovered in another classroom, painted by a fifth grader in 1963, almost 50 years ago. And it looks like either they were just sitting there for all this time or they had fallen behind to where no one had noticed them back there. Yeah, anyway, she liked what she saw and found a name on one of them. Thought, why not try to find the young artist? I typed into yellowpages.com, told us the last name, and I got one listing. Ann Guagliardo, now Ann Shelby's parents, still live in Tulsa, and they passed the message the art teacher at McKinley wanted to talk to her. I was amazed. I was amazed. She told me she didn't remember specifically painting these, but it's her style and she recognizes the place. Most of the time I was painting my great aunt's farm that is out in Creek County because that was my favorite she, thing. She even recognizes her dog. That's Carl. <laughs> <laughs> so that was really your dog? Yes. Anne has graduated to more grown-up art now. Among other things, she paints masks. Miss <laughs> Santiago asked to keep one of the paintings. She wants to frame it and hang it as an inspiration to her students, like these young Picassos creating collages of fall color. In line, in line, in line. Very nice. Rick Wells, The News on 6. And Shelby says the artwork find has helped her reconnect with McKinley and her artist roots. She donates art supplies to the school, hoping to help some of the young students develop their own artistic talent. How about that? That's, That's a very a cool story. story.